Hey boys and girls, this is Brian Ramirez again with Tech of Tomorrow here for you. We've got another review. This is the Swift Tech Polaris 120 heat sink for your CPU. Well, here we have for you the Swift Tech Polaris 120. It's already set up on the test bench. And we've had it running for some time now. It's been doing Prime 95. And we have the AMD Phenom 2 1090T processor, that's a 6-core processor, running at 3.2 gigahertz. And right now it's currently running at about 38 degrees Celsius. And Prime 95 has been running for a good half hour to almost 40 minutes now. So you can see that this heatsink actually does a really good job of keeping the processor cool, even when it's running uh, Prime 95, which stresses out the processor to its full extent. Does not run all that loudly. Uh, we do have it running right now at uh, maximum. It, it runs anywhere from 750 to 2500 RPM depending on how you have it set up on the motherboard. You can run it off of your motherboard header or if you want you can even plug it into a 12 volt Molex connector that's entirely up to you. Personally, uh, if it were me, I would definitely have this running off of the motherboard header. That way you can uh, ramp up or ram, ramp down the speed of the fan depending on what you're doing. It does run a lot quieter when you have it uh, running off the motherboard. This has been the Swift Tech Polaris 120 heat sink and fan. One other thing that I have to mention is that this fan comes, this heat sink and fan comes in at about $60 uh, retail which for its price is actually really really good. This is going to give you performance in the range of heat sinks that cost anywhere from $15 to $20 more. So what you're getting is something that really comes in at a good price and is going to give you good value for your money. Thank you so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe.